What's up, party people? I'm here to share my recent experience checking out a cool spot at the Delaware Water Gap. Doing some research online, I read about the remnants of a couple train derailment accidents here, so of course, I had to come check it out, see if I could find it for myself. I remember coming here as a kid. You know, camping, hiking trails, canoeing down the water gap, stuff like that. I never considered diving here until I found out about some of the train wreckage that could be found still underwater. So, using just a set of coordinates that I found online, I crossed over the tracks, made my way through some bushes, and got myself into the water to go looking for some boxcars. The footage here was from April 2022. Much to my dismay, visibility was absolutely zero. <laughs> After a few short dives to no avail, I realized it'd be a good idea to just call it and come back another day. After looking into it a little bit further, I came to find that the visibility in the springtime is actually really, really poor, but the water clarity is better at the end of the summer and into the fall. So I decided to come back in August 2022 with a few friends. I came with Coastal Case again, my buddy Danny, as well as a couple of my other friends who just wanted to enjoy the nature. Luckily for us, visibility was fantastic this day. And guess what, y'all? We found what we were looking for. got a huge sense of accomplishment from finding this wreck, especially given that half the thing is covered in mud and silt. <laughs> this was a really fun dive. The scenery was actually really beautiful as we swam around. And of course, Postal Case got some really, really cool photos of Danny and I. After we finished diving and checking out this train wreck, a few of us decided to drive a few minutes north and hike part of the Mount Mincy Trail. This was just a great time, hanging out, spending time with some friends, and man, that view is killer. Thanks a lot for watching this video, really do hope you enjoyed it and I hope it was educational. Take care, and until next time.